<coughs> Yo, I got a big question. Make your last relationship. Look how good you treat him. You could birth like four of him. I just want to get into it, so I'm not going to even say my intro. If you know my name, you know it's down there somewhere, okay, for you. I want to know. I really, 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 really want to know why boys can't handle rejection. Huh? Huh? D do y'all know? Do y'all know? And if, if it's some dudes watching this, do y'all know? Can you tell me why? Because I'm, I'm trying to understand. Maybe if I understand, I could handle it a little better, but I need to know. This question was brought up because I had like a little, not an incident, but not altercation, but let me give y'all some background information, background information. So this happened like a week or so ago, right? So I'm walking, I'm walking to my, um, no, I'm walking to go get some food because your girl's hungry. You know, your girl need to eat, your girl's hungry. It was like, I think it was like 12-ish, one o'clock and I was hungry. I was like, I need to go for the cafeteria close. So I'm, I'm rushing. Hey, she's a runner, she's a track star. She gonna run away when it gets hard. I'm halfway to the cafeteria, right? I'm walking, I'm about to turn a corner and I see these two dudes and I think they were football players. I don't know. They had on the little football jerseys. I don't know if they was real football jerseys or they was like, you know, the ones you buy the you put them on. I don't know. But I see them like with a little What's the middle piece with the grass and stuff is? Basically like on the lawn or whatever, right? And I'm about to turn a corner. I keep on walking. I pass the two dudes, right? But they screaming to another dude. And they just screaming, telling him, come on, you need to hurry up, da, 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 da. Mind you, it was warm that day. And I'm walking, I had on, um, what I have on? I had on some jeans and a shirt. And my hair was just like this. I had my headphones and I was listening to some music, you know, just. And I need you. And I miss you. I was just like that, just like that. I mean, I won't sing it out loud, but I was listening to it in my head. I'm passing the dude that they was yelling at, right? Like, this me, bueno, this me and this the dude, right? I'm just going, bueno, this me and this, this me and this the dude, right? You ain't telling me nothing. This me, this the dude, and I'm going like this. And I'm, I'm like, literally like this. I'm like almost past him, but not past him yet. He go around and say, hey. I'm like, oh, hey, because you know, I'm a friendly girl, you know? You gotta be friendly, don't be rude to people. My mama ain't raised me like that. People ain't raised me like that. So I gotta be nice and friendly if you wanna gain some friends and all right. Then I keep on walking, I'm like, hey. He said, hey, I keep on walking, right? I keep going. And then next thing I know, um, you cute. And I said, oh, thanks, thanks, thanks. I appreciate it, because look, do you see? Okay, okay, okay. So I'm like, thank you, thank you, thank you. And he's like, oh, wait, wait, wait. Let me get, I said, sir, no. <laughs> now I'm being a little over dramatic. I ain't do that. But I was like, no, nah, no, nah, I'm good, I'm good. I'm like, I'm going to the cafeteria, I'm hungry. I'm going to the cafeteria, I'm hungry, I'm hungry, I'm hungry. And mind you, the cafeteria closed at, I think, 1.30. It was like 12, 50, 1 o'clock. And we was close to the cafeteria, but we weren't that close. And I walked slow. Me. I be taking my little dilly, dilly dally time. Be. I was like, no, no, I gotta get to the cafeteria. I can't talk right now. I gotta get to the cafeteria because I'm hungry, I'm hungry, I'm hungry. The dudes that I walked past for, the two dudes that still stand on the little grass thing, they screamed to him, Can I be honey? I don't know where they had to go, but if somebody's yelling at me, I would have told them, Sir, you can go without me. I'm like, No, I gotta go, I gotta go. He was like, come on, let me just talk to you. I said, no. And he was like, um, so you just trying to, um, so you're not trying to talk to me. You think you cute and da 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 da. Huh? Sir, what? What? What are you talking about? First off, mind you, first off, didn't he say when he walked past me the first time, you cute? You cute? Did he not say that? Did y'all hear? I, I heard him say it. Did you? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my God, my poor eye. That's suspicious. And it right here hurt. Oh, that really hurt me. Anyways, he, I'm like, in my head, I'm thinking, didn't he just say I was cute? That was the, like, I don't know why that was the first thing that popped into my head, but that was the first thing that popped into my head. And he like, you think you cute or whatever, so you can't talk to me? Sir, what? I said, what are you talking about? He said, you don't want to stop and talk to me because you think you cute, you think you Sir, sir, who do you think you are, first of all? Second off, I'm cute, but I'll still talk to you out, out this mouth. We could take shots all day. And I was like, uh, so I kept on walking, I kept on walking. I swear, y'all, 
we in a pandemic right here. When it's a lot of people around me walking, I wear my mask. But when I'm walking by myself and it's literally nobody outside, I don't put on my mask because in that day it was like kind of hot and humid. So I was like, no, I'm not gonna put on my mask. I'm like, I had it on like under my chin like this, but I didn't have it on my mouth and my nose, right? When I kept walking, I was like, no, I kept walking because I just didn't want to hear him talking more because- If we being real. So I'm not trying to hear you talk crazy to me, okay? I, yeah, no. So he he going this me walking this way. He going whoosh and he going grab. <laughs> Sir, who you grabbing? <laughs> oh my god, who you grabbing? And y'all, I am not a person to just let anybody touch me. Like I wasn't raised in no no household where people were just allowed to and beat me up and stuff like I'm not an only child but I was raised in an only child household right I was the only child in the house so I ain't had no cousins no brothers none like that to hassle and play and mess with me like that I said do you wanna fight me do you wanna catch these hands bitch I'll catch you in the street some with that beef bitch I'll beat your ass so I don't like when people touch me like that. Like my family, you know, if my family, when they touch me sometimes, I'd be like, can you please stop touching me? So for you to think you <laughs> go put your hands on me and go slide, baby. So when he, like literally I'm walking and he behind me, and he just pulled my shoulder back and I'm like, <gasps> and I turn my head, I'm like, sir. So I turn around, I say, please do not touch me again. I'm leaving now. I, that's literally all I said. And I kept walking. And he like, what if you didn't do it? I ain't turn around, I ain't turn around. And I kept walking, I kept walking. After that, I was like a little riled up. Like, it won't nothing crazy happen. Like, he ain't call me on my name like that. So I won't like, ready to go. It was just like, dudes act like this? What? And after that, I was like, oh my God. Like, I can't believe that happened. Imagine I'm close to the cafeteria. Then here we go. Now I got another one for you. It don't stop right there. It don't stop right there. I got another one for you. I'm walking. The cafeteria is right here. And it's like a little sidewalk right here. Right in the middle where it's split between two buildings. The cafeteria on the side and another building on the side. I'm walking in the middle on a little strip joint. I'm walking. You see some more dudes. It's hot outside. Remind y'all. It's hot outside. These people, when they get hot, they come out in big old groups. Especially on the college campus, okay? They come out in groups, baby. Okay, so I'm walking on a little strip, 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 and I'm in my and mind you, this little situation had just happened, so I'm still in the back of my mind thinking, why do dudes act like that? Da, 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 da. I'm texting on my phone to people, asking my best friend about. Well, I was about to text. I never sent the message because then the dudes that was walking past me, they like walking through the parking lot, and I'm on a little strip. They walk past, and the dude was like, hey, hey, hey. First off, first off, first off, I. Hate. Hate is a strong word, okay? But I like, what gives you the reason to think that I'm gonna respond to you when you say, hey, who you talk to? Cause it's show sure enough, not me. I hate dudes that start off a sentence like that or try to approach a girl like that, approach anybody like that. I don't like nobody to approach nobody like that. If I come up to you, I'd be like, hey, hello, hello, how you doing, hey? Not, hey, hey, hey. You can't trust no woman like that. Sir, where were you raised? Besides that, he's like, eh, hey, and I'm, I, I, and to me, that's rude. To me, I'm not gonna walk up to nobody saying that. I don't want nobody walking up to me saying that. So my response was to keep on walking. So remember I said I was texting, so I was still typing, but he had caught my attention. So I had like, I didn't even finish my thing. I just started, I went to Instagram and I started scrolling to pretend I was doing something and I had headphones down. I was like, maybe he gonna think I can't hear him. <laughs> You know how girls be doing that when it's all they think you can't hear them with the left one? Yeah, I did that. I'm about to walk past, right? And I'm walking, walking on, and he like, oh, you you got to do, you got to do, you got to do. Like, he's so loud with it. Like, sir, he yelling, oh, you got to do, you got to do. That's why he ain't talking. Do, do, do. I started laughing, and he said, these, these, did, did. he said something to his friend. He said, these, did, did, did. and I'm like, I just had a feeling he was t talking about me, you know. Probably talking about me. I turned around and I said, I just went just like this. I said, he said, oh, okay, okay, okay. You ain't had to do a brother like that. I said, huh? I just look at him. I'm like, and he was like, well, you didn't do, 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 do. And the fact is that he couldn't even talk right. 
he couldn't even talk right to save his life. <laughs> he couldn't even talk right to save his life. First off, I don't care who you is. If you are in college, that means you are 18 or you are 17 or above, most likely. There are some cases that are that you're not. But if you're in college, you're 17 and above, sir. If you can't speak a proper sentence to me, don't come up to me at all. If you can't speak a proper sentence in general, how do you think you're going to come up talking to a girl that's in college? How do you think you're going to approach a girl like that? Expect me. I'm just talking about me. I don't know about everybody else, but you ain't going to approach me like that, okay? First off, so I was just like, uh, and this is what brings my topic and my question. I specifically titled this video, why do boys, and why can't boys handle rejection very well? And why do dudes feel like they could come up to you and just say whatever come out their mouth and it sounds stupid? Sir, what? First off, you're not coming up to me like that. If you gonna come up to me, you need to have a little something about you need to have first off you need to know how to talk no sir no sir you're not doing this to me so take yourself where you came from but anyways so that's just what brought on my day so i want to know like do y'all experience has it first off has this ever something like this ever happened to you like do dudes just get upset when they don't like when you don't want to talk to them like i have noticed that a lot not just since i've been in college but in general when dudes when dudes come up to you and you tell them that you're not sure you don't want to talk to them or anything like that now you could just be on some I want to be on my own type of stuff. I'm in my element. I'm doing my own stuff right now. You just don't want to talk to dudes like that. That could be your mentality as a woman, as a female. But as soon as you tell them, oh, no, I'm not interested. Oh, no. Or I got a boyfriend or something. Oh, now. Or oh, they want to be like, get upset. Like, sir, you're not me. You can't tell me that I have to talk to you. And if I don't want to talk to you, why are you getting rude about it? Just say, okay. Nobody said we couldn't be friends. Nobody said I wouldn't talk to you later on in the future. And that's how y'all ruin y'all chances with other females. Do y'all know females talk? Females talk. Like, I don't have a lot of female friends. But the ones I do, oh, I tell them everything, okay? It just kind of, like, appalled me. I was flabbergasted. I just had to, like, make a video. And this happened, like, a week ago. And I've been, like, pondering, should I put this on my channel? Should I put this on my channel? Should I put this on my channel? Because I know my family watch, but it's just, I'm like, this really happened in the world. And I and I really want to see how, like, other people deal with it. So if y'all have encountered something like this, then put it down below and, like, tell me about it. Or we could talk about it. In my opinion, I never heard a story about a girl trying to talk to a dude and then a girl getting rude to do say no or something like this like i've seen it in movies but i've never heard about that in person like tv not tv because i said um movies but like i've never heard that like really really happen like in the real world i've only ever heard it come from dudes being rude to a girl when the girl don't want to talk to them at all like sir i'm just really confused like sir do you have any respect for yourself do you realize that you were birthed by a woman a female and you're gonna talk to me like that and you should try to be my man oh no 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 and i'm still it's still kind of like crazy to me because i've never encountered anything like that and the whole the crazy thing about it is i'm a very nice and caring person like i'm not going to be rude to you unless you're rude to me and even if you are rude to me chances are i'm not going to be rude to you the second after you're rude to me unless it's like something crazy like you call me on my name call me on my name it's over i'm not you i have no respect for you that's it period point blank i have no respect for you after that and the fact that you think that you, i just don't understand this is just like a story time slash little chit chat I, I don't even know what i'm gonna title it yet besides the boys thing yeah I, I just don't know i just wanted other people's opinions and i don't i know a lot of people don't watch my channel like that right now but we're gonna be up soon but just in case y'all do i just wanted to put this out here because it was a like what that's suspicious i think that's all i have for you guys if y'all like this type of thing and if something like this ever happens to me again or something in the area or just like a chit chat or something if y'all like these type of videos then let me know this is just kind of like a spur of the moment thing like i like i said this happened last week but it had been like on my mind and i haven't really told anybody to be honest like i put it on my instagram story like just asking why why um dudes can't handle rejection and stuff like that but i haven't like 
talk to anybody about it. And I know it shouldn't affect me like that. Like, it's not like I'm sad over it, but it's just like, people really do this out here. I want to know who your mama was, who your daddy was, why they raised you like this. So if y'all like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and comment down below if y'all want to see other videos like this. If it happens to me or if you guys encounter something like this, let me know what happened down below and we can talk about it. But yeah, that is going to be the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, leave a big thumbs up and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace. Love you. I'm going back, I'm going back